Okay, um, so I want to introduce you to some um, world population uh, websites, as estimates. So we're on one right now, worldometers.info, world population. And uh, the world current world population estimate is 7,774,750,000. Four hundred and eighty-five. So about seven point seven, seven point eight billion. Uh, we also have estimates today of births and births this year, deaths today and death this year, and overall population growth uh, today in this year. So just today alone, population grew by about two hundred thousand. Population growth this year has been almost twenty million already. Um, today, there's been about 350,000 births, um, but almost three, 35 million births this year, 145,000 deaths, and, and almost 15 million deaths this year. So there's other sections and other information on this site if you want to explore it. Here we have a world population graph, our current exponential rise in world population and our world population growth rate. So the growth rate has been going down. That means how fast we're growing. Um, the site has us estimated at 1.05%. Your book and all your book information, it's always a couple of years old because it takes long to take so long to publish a book, uh, has had the most current rate at 1.2%. But about 1.05, a little about 1% anyway, a little over 1%. And then here's world population estimates historically. So in 1955, 1960, there were only, you know, 3 uh, billion people. And then we doubled from 1960 to uh, in, in 2000 to over 6 billion people. Right. Uh, so in just 40, year, 40 years, their world population doubled. And then we have forecast. Now, projections are not the same thing as predictions. Uh, a projection is when we say, okay, if we assume this is the amount of growth, then we take that number out into the future, and this is where what population will be. So here we have different growth rates or different, you know, yearly changes. And um, uh, estimates going up to 2050, we're at 9.7 or so billion people on Earth. Um, so they estimate 2057, 10 billion people, and uh, 2037 for 9 billion people. And by 2023, we will have 8 billion people. All right, so that's that site. What I want to show you um, else that's interesting on the site, though, before we go to the other site, is the coronavirus tab up here. Um, and so I would assume that they are incorporating this kind of new cause of death here um, into these population figures. Uh, current coronavirus cases as of 9.41 p.m. on March 31st. 858,127 with 42,140 deaths and 177,141 recoveries, leaving 638,846 active cases that have been diagnosed, of course, undiagnosed cases are included. Of those active cases, 606 thousand or over 606,000 are currently in mild condition, uh, but 5% or 32,000 are in serious and cri or critical condition. And then we have uh, graphs of the total cases, the total death, and you can look at these logarithmically, which is really nice here. So you click on that now. Um, a log graph uh, shows us when it increases by a factor of 10. So this goes from 1,000 to 10,000, 100,000, 1 million, 10 million. 
increasing by a factor of 10 here. And the same thing for the total number of deaths. 